It's rolling already. <laughs> okay, not great with camera, but let's see how it goes, hey? Hi, my name is Lukas Stachivo and I'm a digital um, IoT services operations manager for services in Australia and New Zealand. Thanks for tuning in and watching me play the Jenga creativity challenge. I stepped out from my day job and um, I hope you're going to enjoy this little experience with myself. Um, let's get to it. Um, try. Try the bottom one first. How did you get started in services? So my journey in services started back in 2008. So when I joined, um, my first services interaction was helping our customers. So I was a technical support engineer. Um, and then I moved into the service, uh, the field-based services role as a network integration engineer. So that was the first experience that I had with the services. And, um, and that was over 15 years ago. Please share a memorable interaction with a customer. I think the one that quite sticks in my head would be where I just started on the field. So I transitioned from a phone-based support into the services role where I was attending customer sites and I have been assigned to a customer in Canberra, um, a very large uh, cloud and service provider. They had, uh, that was probably the first time I saw a, a huge data center. So you enter the room full of racks, rows and rows of racks. And my task was to actually do an audit on the temperature sensors. So imagine you're looking at this wall of racks and every single rack has a sensor on it. And my task was to make sure that every sensor is linked to the device that monitors that sensor. I really learned how to be patient and how to be um, accurate with my uh, outcomes. And it um, and turned out to be a really good experience in the end. Um, customer was really happy and fast forward 12 to 14 years, they're still with us. And that's one of the largest service contracts that we have in the whole of our region. So that's a, that's a great customer. That's a great Australian story. They've grown to this um, amazingly um, important part of the Australian business. And we have as services, we've been part of their journey. What do you enjoy most about your job? I think the one thing that I always enjoyed about being part of the services team and which, which actually kind of aligns with how I am, um, I like to help, I, I love to help people. Um, that's not just our customers, that's really everyone around me. And, um, and being in services and being, having that ability to help people and see the outcome and um, see the smiles on the faces when something goes right and, and we are able to resolve the issues. That's, that's definitely one of the great, um, great experiences that I enjoy every day. And probably the other thing um, is that no day is the same as the last day. So um, with services, we support such a wide portfolio of products and solutions that um, having an experience to work with those solutions means that every day brings a new challenge. So that really helps me pretty much um, every time that I feel my performance review and I talk about the learn every day, well, that's my life. We learn every day because every day is different to the day before that. Why do you think services is the best place to level up in your career? When you enter the services division and um, you start to realize that we are probably one of the only business units that is able to get exposure to all different technologies. We support secure power as well as the power system, as well as the power products, as well as the industry, as well as the digital power. So ability to have this wide range of products that we are working with every day and um, an ability to choose the path that you want to go to. You, you know, you could choose to be a person that fixes the problems on the customer sides. There is a role right there for you. So ability to, um, to resolve the issues and go to site and troubleshoot the problems, that's what our service technicians do every day. If you choose to um, think more about the commercial, techno-commercial side of, the, um, or, or, of, of, your, um, of your abilities, then there's a role for you right there in the tendering team. If I think about being great with the customers and and being um, motivated by being able to produce the solutions for them, 
and there is a solution architect role for you. If I think about being a salesperson, you do have a sales, a sales division as well. So there's lots of different um, choices and you can actually switch in between. If I reflect on my own career, I think I have done most of the available uh, career paths and, um, and um, I enjoyed all of them. So um, I hope that you will find a place for yourself and I would be amazing if you join our team. Thank you. Thank you.